on the next episode of The Walking Dead. Our plan is the same, four groups, two in each. We're not all gonna make it through, but this is the only way. It's too late. Our rendezvous is set in stone. They're coming up. This journey must be completed. Welcome to Knock Pro Nation. Welcome back guys, Jarrell here. And I'm Josh. And today we're here to review the season finale of The Walking Dead. We're gonna hit break down some photos for you, have a discussion about what's coming for the season finale of season 10. Later on in the year, unfortunately, so episode 16 is titled A Certain Doom. And basically the synopsis is Beta engages in the final battle of the Whisperer War. So it's gonna be interesting. I, I have a feeling it's not gonna happen in Alexandria like it did in the comic books, but We'll see if they break out of the tower. Maybe they can head back to Alexandria and fight there. We you did. Know, we have a lot to figure out. We did get a shot in one of the trailers of them in a field. So mm -hmm. yeah. I, I'm still holding out hope that it goes down outside, you know, in yeah. the open. Uh, but you know, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see, guys. So let's break into this. Uh, kind of a similar scene of what we got in the sneak peek where Gabriel is assembling with everybody, trying to figure out how the hell they're going to get out of there. And it's just him kind of going through the halls, just figuring stuff out. We saw this again where he's just looking out the window, seeing the massive amount of walkers and whisperers coming inside this hospital. And they need to get the hell out of there as quickly as possible. Yes, they do. <laughs> uh, that's a shot there of them just looking at the whisperers and walkers. You can tell there's... Look at that. Look at that. That's a whisper right there, guys. I'm going to circle yeah. it. Look at that clean <laughs> skin. That clean neck. Clean neck skin. <laughs> so... Gabriel talking to everybody, you know, he kind of says in the teaser, this is, we're sticking to the plan. We, we, we're we going out kind of like group by group. So they're going to get groups, they're going to head out, and from some of these pictures, guys, they're going to be doing the blood and guts trick, which we'll see. So. Yes, obviously see Daryl in the background. He yeah. makes it back. We did see that in the sneak peek of the finale, so... yeah. Yeah, guys. It's going to be sweet. It's a weird kind of picture here of Carol looking like she's sticking a shiv up her sleeve, maybe before she heads out. Not really sure, but she has a weird look on her face, and Lydia's kind of looking at her behind her, like, "What are you hiding? Like, why do you need to hide a shiv under your arm? I don't get that's, it. That's strange. Why would you be hiding that? Like, if you're gonna fight whisperers, oh, or unless because if they're using the blood and guts trick, they want to look like they're walkers that's and true. they want to yeah. hide their yeah. weapons. Yeah. So that that obviously, makes sense. a walker is not gonna hold a knife. Yeah, that's <laughs> what the whisperers do. So look right here, oh, Luke gosh. and Jules. The, people are getting prepped to do the blood and guts trick. So they're using the ponchos, kind of like what we saw last time there was an invasion of Alexandria. Yep. Uh, so it's pretty cool. Just make sure you don't get it on your face and you don't want to be blind like uh, Father, uh, Father Gabriel. Gabriel. Yeah, Negan, nothing happened to Negan, though. Of course not. He's immortal. <laughs> uh, so this must be, we see kind of Daryl and Carol inside the door. There's Judith on the outside. Maybe Daryl is putting her here to keep her safe. For the meantime, I'm not really sure what this what this yeah, is. Yeah, I don't think this is a, hey, I'm locking you in here type no. situation because uh, Judith has been known to not listen and follow, you know, instructions. Um, but I think this is just a mutual agreement between them two. Like, look, you have to sit this one out and take care of the kids. It could be maybe stay here until the, the our first group leads a lot of the walkers out of there mm -hmm. and then she's like the second wave where she can go daryl's in his poncho he's in his poncho yep. yeah yeah oh beta says begin and you see all these walkers like turn around like it's time to go inside like <laughs> beta, i love that you know ryan hurst asked if he could have gold teeth for beta it's of course not in the comic books he wanted it specifically for this yep. character so it's pretty cool uh just another shot here of beta you know, just doing his walk. He's got to have that shoulder propped up. He's got to be a walker, right? And our gang is coming to... They're trying to get to the meeting with Stephanie. They're on bicycles. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. Cool here, guys. Uh, Princess has her spear. She has her spear. Yeah. She, she did say in the episode, I think we were kind of laughing right when she said that. Um, but she said she wants to go get her gear. She says, I have a cool spear. And I have some candy. So. <laughs> so it's cool. But you can see the look of desperation on Eugene. He knows, like, we can't miss this meeting. I yeah. cannot miss this. We're, the reason we're here, I can't miss it. So yep. he's definitely trying. Uh, so back inside the hospital there, they've barricaded the door. And Judith, you know, they're kind of pushing through. So Judith kind of says they're coming. Uh, we get, I uh, forget her name, but she's from Oceanside. Yep. 
there. Uh, guys, Kelly is putting on a Whisperer mask. Now I will show you something that we over what we didn't know about in the promotional photo from when they were talking about the season coming to an end later this year. So as you can see, she's putting on the mask. So this is the shot of Daryl. Does that her? That is, has to be Kelly behind him yeah, right there, dude. Sweet. Isn't that sick? Yeah, that's sick. So that's the picture that they posted up when they announced that they weren't going to be posting it. But I, yeah, that's Kelly. At yeah, first I, we were just like, oh, that's a whisper. I'm, oh, that's wondering if, I'm wondering if obviously the game plan here is for them to infiltrate the, the horde and do the opposite of what the whispers are doing. Almost yeah. take them in a separate direction. Herd them yeah. in a separate direction. But they're going to have to be careful because there's going to be whispers amongst them. So they're going to see that they're yeah. there and yeah. we'll figure it out. But you have to think about it like this. The whispers can't make sudden sudden moves because then the walkers will turn on them. So, you know, they can't yep. be too loud. So there's a shot of Jerry. He's all ready to go. Is that one right there? A whisper? Yeah. I can't tell. It looks but like it. It kind of look like looks like the hole is cut out the, the eye, eye opening. Yeah, a little bit. It's pretty scary. There's Luke and Jules there just letting the walkers walk right by them as they're trying to get out. I mean, just look at the fear on their faces. <laughs> I'd be scared too, I'm surprised man. surprised they don't put blood on their face. They probably I mean, learned... We've seen that from Nick and Fear the Walking Dead. Well, they probably learned from Father Gabriel, yeah. don't put it on your face. Yeah. You know, so, yeah, they're trying to be safe. There's a shot of Daryl there. He's letting the walkers come by him, but he's going outside. So they're going to be trying to herd this place away. Now, this is where I still think Father Gabriel may still get his comic book death because in the trailer, he's talking to Diane, telling it's Diane's turn for her to go on watch. So if Father Gabriel stays behind and makes sure everyone gets out, he could be the only one left and he could potentially still get it. Yeah, it'd be upsetting if it, if it happens here and right. not where it's supposed to happen. Right, in Alexandria, yeah. So, like I said, it could change it up. So this is the part right here again we saw from the sneak peek, but this is where we believe Aaron and Alden escape from being captured. We think that in the episode there was somebody who pointed a gun at them, which was off camera. Maybe it was one of our survivors dressed up as a whisperer coming to help at the last second. Not really sure, but yeah. um, it's interesting though. Boom! Comic book source material right there it's an easter egg yard yeah yep. <laughs> nice train gotta love it gotta man love gotta it, love man. it they're meeting stephanie in the trail in the train yard so pretty cool and uh another shot here angela kang did confirm that the reason they made the change um from the commonwealth city is just because of the distance and what they've had planned for the universe so stay tuned we'll have another video talking about that yep. so that's really cool and basically you uh ezekiel just talking to eugene saying look we have to make this meeting this is something that we are going to do. You know, we're here. Let's get it done. Yep. So we got to get it done. So, yeah, guys, that's the teaser. I, yeah. I suspect that there's probably going to be a sense of urgency as, like, they miss the meeting. Like, they think that yeah. no one showed up. And, and what's going to happen, guys, is mm -hmm. the lights are going to shine on them. Yeah. And behind those lights <laughs> is going to be some pretty serious uh, group of people. Yeah. So uh, I think in the teaser... Uh, Eugene kind of says that he thinks that they've missed the meeting. You know, they think that they're, yeah, yeah. they're arriving late. No. And, um, yeah, I think, you, you know, Ezekiel's just keeping them, keeping them calm, keeping them cool. Like, we can't give up. We have to get Because, I mean, in the source material, Stephanie's not even there at the, at the meet. Yeah, she's not there yet. So we're excited for this. We, uh, fortunately, of course, don't have a release date yet. But we'll, once that comes out, we'll definitely do a video and let you guys know. But um, we'll have many more theories and videos coming for the, for the finale. So stay tuned. We appreciate your support as always. Make sure you like the video. Feel free to subscribe. I'm Darrell. I'm Josh. We're an Nation. We're out. out.